stuffed up that silliness. Um, I thought I'd do a quick video because all the kids are doing them these days. Um, I'll do a quick unboxing of the Hellboy box game from Mantic, which I purchased at Salute this Saturday just gone. Um, so I think everyone's probably pretty much seen the box because I think it's been doing the rounds on YouTube and that kind of thing um, with the Kickstarter and stuff. But And I get from looking, I think the retail box is just probably slightly smaller than the, well, considerably smaller than the some of the, uh, the Kickstarter boxes. But uh, lovely big Mike Mingola Hellboy on the on the front, got Abe on that side, um, the same Hellboy on that side, and there's Liz there, and I guess it's Kraus there. Right now, we'll open it up, see what's inside. Doing this one handed. Right, first things on the top is the card stock. Fairly hefty, get the hard pick up. Um, tokens, obviously that's just a bit of artwork on the side, some of the box cover. And tiles, um, obviously reminiscent a bit of um, Mansions of Madness. By Final Air uh, Fancy Flight. How many got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven separate boards. I'm guessing they're all pop out tails as well. Um, very nicely done. And um, what else we got here? Star Saga Flyer, Dungeon Saga Flyer on the other side. With a board game. Resume our stat cards, special rules, unique actions. There looks to be four in there, so I'm guessing that's one per main carrot in a box. Um, places for putting dice and that kind of thing there. Tutorial, read this first. Obviously, uh, learn to play kind of thing. Counter deck. Doom. Looks like he's basically playing with Abe and Hellboy. Obviously have a play through this first. Main rule book. Again. See everything again. Lovely all. Make me go the artwork all the way through. Um I mean as I think everyone knows it's based on the comic, not the films. Uh, I haven't seen a single Picture of uh, Ron Pillman's big chin and anything actually. So uh, not that there's anything wrong with films. I do like the films. Looking forward to the new one. But um, obviously um, the original Mike Mingola Dark Horse comics are one of my top favorite comics of all time. Um, why I didn't back the um, Kickstarter? I must have had a moment of uh, sanity. Just thought what, what, what my wife might say if a big box came in. So any gribblies. Big tentacle face dude. I think initially when I first saw him, I thought he was going to be the monster. I can't think of his name. Who's in the Golden Army. The guy with the metal fist on the chain. Yeah, but he's not. Um... Very old one, Cthulhu y kind of look going on. I mean, that seems to be the theme of the whole box. As we move on to some tentacles, very nice. Um, it's hard to tell, but you can see it's probably pretty much the size of two of these. So it's a big thing. Same with this guy here. Um, one thing I do like is you can see it's actually smashing up through the floorboards. Which is quite nice, very nice. Main sort of minis. Um, these are little frog swarms, which I think are quite nice. I'll not get them out. 
Actually, I'm not getting any of the main bad guys out. It's again, it's a repetition of three of the same figures for each one. Um, again, very fishy, fishy man looking. Obviously, again, with a Kickstarter, you get a huge amount more. Um, the main figures, uh, Ra Ra Rasputin, lover of the Russian Queen. Very nice. Very nice indeed. That's gross. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to paint him. I want to keep it very close to the comic, so I will be using no uh, oil on these. Lots of it. There's Liz, a uh, very nice figure. I had thought she had a pistol in that hand, but I must have been. Unless it's a, a, like a kickstarter um, stretch goal or something. I like the flames in the hands, so well. that's cool. That's going to be nice to paint. Abe. Um, oh no, Abe's got a pistol. I'm wondering if I'm getting that mixed up with Liz. Again, another one. I'm not sure how I'm going to paint them. We'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see. And then finally, Big Red. Beautiful. I've been wanting to get my hands on this figure for some time. I just love the, the weight of him. He's really nicely done. Um, very true to the comic. Love that. Now, I think there's more stuff in here. More cards and counters. Uh, oh, more oh. secret plastic as well. So, these look like bases to go. I'm guessing on the main heroes just to differentiate them. A similar sort of thing in Conan, actually, but more for the bad guys. Uh, now, I don't know what they're for, but obviously, those match the colours of those. And there's black ones. I don't know what they are. Okay, I'm going to read the rules. Mid-game game of tiddlywinks, if we want. But oh, what hazard, I guess. They're probably going to be something to do wound markers or blood drops. Something like that. Encounter deck. Oh, cool little picture of uh, young Hellboy. Very interesting. The deck of doom again I mean it's hard to tell because I haven't unwrapped them but they feel nice and they uh, solid that looks feels like they're gonna be nice quality cards and case files uh, this is the back of the case file deck to avoid does that say spoilers turn it over and only look at it from the top card oh, I like these so these are obviously sealed so I'm presuming that each one's a different scenario. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm guessing that's six separate missions, I guess. So that would be pretty cool when you're first playing it. Um, all in all, I'm very happy. Um, oh, one thing I haven't looked at is the dice. Um, looks like fairly standard. A couple of ordinary six-sided, a couple of specialist dice. I think the black ones are just dice, but with different sort of like Templar esque. Who knows? Well, I'm sure. I mean, I'll actually no, they're not actually because there's there's four, there's two lots of threes. Oh, I don't know, but uh, yeah, I'll have to read the rules, I guess. I don't know. But um, yeah, very happy with it. Figures are lovely. Um. So you have to read the rules, but quality is brilliant. Um, so yeah, we'll have to have a game of it and see what we think. But anyway, that's uh, Hellboy, the retail version. I um, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, I <laughs> hope you enjoyed it. Anyway, thanks a lot, guys. I'll speak to you soon. Cheers.